Curious Wacking is Brother King's for new World of Creep Six Chicken Sandwich We will Spatty Bucky Do Plus More BK by Timmy Tackett. Like a link to the video will, will be the description below. Go and check them out. So let's into this working in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> I'm practicing my princess wave. BK just dropped a new line of chicken sandwiches and they're called the BK Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwiches. So I guess they're made exclusively for people of royalty like myself. Uh, 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 These counters? It? are made of gold. They're just painted to look like trashy stone because I want to be relatable. Actually, the rest of my house is a palace. And I just, I haven't shown you guys palace. this. I just don't want to flaunt. I'm just not that kind of girl. There are four very like different ten. flavors like <laughs> of this chicken sandwich. I got all four. I'm going to taste test them, give you my honest opinion, rate them from one to 10 and let you know if they're worth buying, okay? So the first flavor is just BK Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwich, a crispy white meat chicken breast filet topped with the brand's new savory royal sauce. What is that? Is it made of caviar? Champagne. And it also has lettuce and tomatoes on a toasted potato bun. Oh, we love that Idaho. That one is $5.09. And then the next one is BK Spicy Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwich. A crispy white meat chicken breast filet coated with the chain's new triple pepper spicy glaze. Oh my God. And topped with the savory sauce, lettuce and tomatoes on a toasted potato bun. That one is $5.89. So the sauce costs 80 cents more. Interesting. And then the next one is wow, BK really? Bacon and Swiss Cheese Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwich. A crispy white meat chicken breast filet topped with BK's new royal sauce, creamy Swiss cheese, crispy bacon, lettuce, and tomatoes, all sandwiched between a toasted potato bun. That one is $6.49. And the big final one is the barbecue bacon and cheese. BK Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwich. What a long name. A crispy white meat chicken breast filet topped with southern spiced barbecue sauce, crispy bacon, and melted American cheese. All served on a toasted potato bun. That one, it doesn't say the price, but guys, these sound genuinely incredible and I'm so hyped. Let's open this bag up. Ooh, it's big. This is the barbecue. That's big, it's heavy. And then we have the bacon. This must be the Swiss and bacon. And then C, what does C mean? C, 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 C. Classy? <laughs> Me? Um, and then this see? one is, <laughs> okay, so this is crispy and this is spicy crispy, S-C? I guess, I don't know. But before we start guys, I just wanna say thank you so much to everyone that gave me super thanks on my last video. I'm so grateful. Thank you to Amanda Claire, um, Margaret Teague, Lexi Crustina, um, Krista, and Selfless Flower. <laughs> I love that name. Thank you guys so much. I'm so grateful. Your generosity means the world to me. And it literally paid for this video. So thank you. Also guys, subscribe to my channel so you stick out for more fast food reviews and full menu taste tests. I try all the brand new items. These came out yesterday, so I'm almost on point. And, and subscribe to me for to see more fast food fast food re re reactions. Subscribe. <laughs> so subscribe. Okay, so let's first try the original, like the main crispy one. I'm nervous. Ooh, okay. Honestly, the fillet looks a bit thin for my taste. There's the royal sauce. Oh, I can smell yeah. the gold. And I the tomato and the lettuce gold. and more sauce here. That's good. Okay. Oh, thumbnail. Hold on. Okay, go ahead. Let's try this chicken sandwich. I'm nervous. It's, it's a whole new line, guys. A whole new thing. Very interesting. I like it, but it's strange.
Hmm. Okay. I have thoughts. It's good. It's good. It's just weird. So, it looks like a normal chicken sandwich, but it does not taste like one. The chicken, first of all, is thin, but it does taste real. It does not taste like a giant chicken nugget. It tastes good. Okay. A bee chicken nugget. <laughs> Second of all, tomatoes, lettuce, all taste fine. The potato bun just tastes like a normal bun to me. I can't tell the difference. I don't taste any tight uh, tots in there. The main star here is the royal sauce. It doesn't taste fancy, that's for sure. It's creamy and it has a strong flavor. And that flavor reminds me of stuffing. <laughs> like Thanksgiving stuffing, guys. There's some sort of an herb in it that is also in stuffing that just is serving stuffing. And with the breading on the chicken, which tastes kind of like bread, and the bread itself, the whole sandwich kind of tastes like stuffing. <laughs> Good stuffing, but stuffing nonetheless. What does nonetheless mean? I'm not sure, but I used it so perfectly. It's good, it's just like, so weird. It's weird. And that's not a bad thing, it's just weird. So just expect a stuffing flavor profile. I'm giving the main one, I think, a six out of 10, six out of 10, yes. Okay. Next up, let's try, I think, the bacon and Swiss. Because the other two, like the spicy and the barbecue, sound so strong. Um, so I'm saving those for last. Okay, hello. Wow, this one looks better and bigger. The bacon looks like just very thick. Like there's like a lot of it. Where's the Swiss really though? Thick. I don't see Swiss. Oh, <gasps> they forgot the Swiss, they forgot the Swiss, okay. Okay, something always happens guys, every time. But it does have four slices of bacon. That's a lot of bacon. Like that's good. Oh, the Swiss, that would have added like a nice tang for sure. Let's try the pig version. Mm. That sauce really comes through, even through the bacon. It's very surprising. It's strong. Yeah, pretty good bacon. Not Wendy's good. Wendy's has the best bacon, but his bacon isn't bad. It's a bit salty though. So, this is good. This is definitely a um, step up from the first. Mm. It's still not fantastic, but the bacon and the stuffing sauce, those flavors go so well together. And the bacon really adds a nice extra bit of texture. It's like chewy and um, a bit crispy. It's good. You know what? You know what the sauce tastes like? Ranch meets stuffing. That is what the sauce tastes like. So overall, this is good. It is, once again, interesting, different. And I love the flavors of the bacon and the sauce together. So I'm gonna give the bacon version, I think a nice seven out of 10. It's good. And I do just wanna say again, these are super different from your typical chicken sandwich. Don't expect that experience. They taste like their own thing. Okay. Next up, let's try, I think, the spicy one and then barbecue. Okay. This is spicy. I'm excited. It has like a three chili or like spicy. a three pepper sauce. That sounds fun. I love spicy things. I don't like That's spicy things. Looks. Let's open it up. Okay. It looks very sauced up yet still crispy. So that's good. Let's try it. Mm. Hmm. 
The spice is starting to come through. Okay. Wow. That's a good Ooh. level of spicy. I like that. I would say, at least on my spicy o meter, um, I would say it's a four out of ten. But um, I love spicy food. I have a high tolerance for it. So to some people, this could be like a seven or an eight. Mm. Mm. So. The pepper flavor itself isn't super strong. It is there for sure, but it's a light flavor. It's like a light peppery kind of, maybe a bit of cayenne, a bit of paprika type of flavor. And it's good. It is spicy enough and I like it. Um, This one definitely tastes less like stuffing. I think that the spicy sauce really balanced that out and just made it taste like its own thing, like a creamy kind of spicy moment. Um, wow, really? But it still tastes different and good. I think I'm gonna give it a nice 7.5 out of 10. Okay, so last but not least, we have the barbecue bacon cheese one. Oh my goodness. I'm ready. And don't forget to drop a like on this reaction and if this reaction is five likes, then I will try Burger King's chicken sandwich. Oh, five likes. So, double like. And I'm not trying the spicy chicken sandwich or the pork to chicken sandwich. Because I don't like them. So, yep. Here yeah, we try the regular chicken sandwich. So, double like. Five likes and then we try them. Ooh, okay. So, this one. It has the cheese. We love that. Has a lot of bacon once again a lot of barbecue sauce oh a lot of barbecue sauce yes both sides we love that let's try it mm. I'm getting full. Okay. Ooh! So I think this one works the best. The barbecue sauce is very nice. It's sweet, super tangy, a tiny, tiny bit spicy. Just a, just a smidge. And the crispy bacon, the crispy chicken, the cheese, it all goes so well together. And the bun too. Everything tastes really, really good. I love this sandwich. I think mm -hmm. it's fantastic. I think it's my favorite for sure. King! I'm ready, marry me. Um. Wow, so I'm giving this one, I think, a nine out of 10. And yeah, overall, this line is very interesting, very different, and I really appreciate all the different flavors and toppings. They are each their own experience, like they really are. Even if that experience kind of tastes like Thanksgiving stuffing. Let me know in the comments below, do you guys plan on trying these new Royal BK chicken sandwiches? If you do, tell me all your thoughts. And once again, thank you so much to all my super thanks queens and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys next video. I love you so much. Ooh. Thank you for watching, queen. I'm so grateful that you... <laughs> that was Burger King's four new water crispy chicken sandwich review. Spicy bucket you plus more BK by Timmy Tagat. The link to the video will be the description. Below, go and check them out. Drop a like if you like, and comment on the bit below if you want to see more reactions like this one. And subscribe if you want to, and click the post to be notified when I upload in the month. Bye.